to becoming international secret agents. In other words, Psychonauts! Hey guys, I hope you're hungry. Welcome back to Psychonauts here on the Full Incense channel. My name is Jericho. In the last episode, you guys, we defeated the Lungfish eventually and made it into our next mind, Lungfishopolis. Which, as you can see, is quite different from the other ones we've seen so far in the game. Um, once again, I'm spoiled by newer games and I forgot to save it properly. So I might have done a little bit more or a little bit less than I was um, the last time around. And if so, I beg your indulgence. I'm not trying to get anything over on anybody. I just messed it up. So I'll try to remember for my horrifying mistakes, but we'll see. Well, things have gotten a little embarrassing for Gagalore. Recently surfaced information has strongly linked the previously intimidating monster with common low-life criminals. Earlier tonight, I don't remember this. Gagalore broke some oh, yeah. of his jailhouse cronies out of the See, slammer, yeah, so they could enjoy a night on the but, town. Um, anyway, I freed the resistance lungfish that realized that they're well, being uh, mind-controlled to help hangover. me uh, get past the Navy has come up destroy with a Kutamara. new invention. Trucks armed with hyper-electricity. Kidnapping children do not harm the brains. Yeah, see, it's not so good. They're, 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 they're spreading some not so nice messages. I think that hyper, or well, that tank just killed his friends. I think the hyper-electricity was supposed to block with my new ability. Yeah, there we go, pass the ticket. I'm just kind of exploring right now. Um, this isn't the way I'm supposed to go. There's a uh, hall of lasers I'm supposed to be dealing with. So I, I guess I'll go back and do that actually, because I'm sure I'll have to come this way later anyway. Still can't do anything with the mental cobwebs yet. Um, I haven't. I still haven't taken the time to um, pluck some arrowheads to be able to afford the cobweb duster. But I'll do it one of these days. I promise. Um, yeah, we'll go back. We'll get back to that later. I do want this duffel, this, uh, rain splim though. That's kind of funny. I've never seen, noticed that before. Ho, oh, wahoo. There we go. Uh, one cool thing about this level is the water. I don't think there's any, there's any, um, stage of the, um, <laughs> match factor. I don't think there's any part of the water in this level that's deep enough, um, for you to have your usual weakness. Because you still be. Okay, so yeah, let's just, um, keep moving on. I wish there was a different sound when you picked up health versus money versus the other stuff. Just speaking for myself. Okay, I got a shield as soon as I get in there. Yay! So now we can destroy this prison and just uh, a rampage. Oh god, speaking of rampage. Use the shield. Use the shield! <clears throat> okay, that's not doing me any good. Evasive maneuvers it is. Oh, there's the duffel bag tag. I can head back and get that once I'm done um, in this area, if and I remember. I think that's a duffel bag tag. Duffel bag tag. Bag tag, what a drag, as they say. Freedom! 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 <laughs> Freedom! <clears throat> so, this big monster, is that the best you could do? Don't be mean. We were short on time, and he is good at smashing things. Don't be mean. Doesn't look like much to me. Come on, let's blow this joint. Hey, you're welcome. Yeah. Sorry about him, Gargalore. He's him. been in prison a long time. He's the only pilot the Resistance has, and he has an excellent plan. Meet us at the dam so we can put it into action. I think a bounce on the blimp, like those brains things, is leading me. Oh, whoa, oh, oh. whoa. I, I don't know about uh, a whole lot about blimp. What, 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 what's up with blimp? Um. <gasps> What's up with Blimp Aerodynamics? Because I don't think that's, I don't think that's quite true. I think it'd be cool if this level had like a mock GTA, um, like a GTA style, like awareness meter, like the the Lungfish uh, or the Kochamra with the Rain Watch people would would send more, um, like the stronger the, those electricity tanks I was just tangling with, like as you destroyed stuff. I think that'd be kind of, kind of neat. Okay, so let's go back and get that duffel bag tag real quick, and then we'll advance towards the dam. And that crawler thing is going to be blasting in the corner this whole episode, I unfortunately. Complain, I should have just Chamera gone back. Do something. Does this reflect those missiles? No, it just stops them. So it's not really worth my time. It's not like the, um, the electricity tanks where it also takes them out in the bargain. Don't worry, Duffy. I gotcha. Duffy the bag pyre. The, the bag... Duffy the luggage bag player. 
That's almost too good. What did I read about Buffy lately? Are they making more episodes or something? Re reboot? I don't think it's a reboot. I think, I think they're making more episodes or something. Something. Maybe a new spinoff? Um, Science Century, my wife is really into Buffy. I, I, the few episodes I've seen, I, I liked okay. Um, to me, it's not like as polished as some of Joss Whedon's other stuff. Like when I compare it to my sweet precious Firefly, which I'm planning on talking about in a war story one of these days. Um, but yeah, the, the time for that will come. The destruction and terror continue as the hulking, godless child <laughs> beast carves a bloody swath through our Swath, that's a city. good word. It's kind of, like, it sort of sounds like suave. Volunteer suave, has suave. Been surprised only by the senseless lust for mayhem that seeps from the twisted black <laughs> lump of a heart in this creature, still known only as Gogalor. Gogalor is a cool oh, name. I want to think of a Pokemon that would be an appropriate forms, nickname for The Navy Gogalore. has no choice but to activate its anti-monster turrets which it guarantees are 100% monster-proof. Well, but Dr. I'm not really a monster, so if it doesn't work against me, that doesn't disprove the, the Navy's motion. Oh, boy. Was that really low on health, or did that do a, 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 good, a good amount of damage? I'm gonna step on some of these guys because I'm sad. You see him get a little bit squishied? <laughs> Where's the turret? I think I need to take it out before I can move on. Oh yes, it does a ton of damage. <laughs> now you see the genius of our plan, Gogalore. First we print flyers, then we spread them all over town with my blimp. Winning over the hearts and minds of Lungfishopolis in as soon as six months. <laughs> Leaflet campaign. Six I think this months. world is short. That's you like the one thing about plan. it. Like, I'm glad that it doesn't overstay its welcome. The jokes yes, would, get, we would get older. We have to select card but, stock um, and then find a decent but inexpensive This is, within I think, one of the shortest worlds. I'm pretty sure that after you hop over, there's not a whole lot left. You gotta go destroy the tower, and then you... F I don't know. I don't want to give away. But I don't think there's too, too much left. Did I not do that a long time ago? I like how you scale the bigger buildings that you can't just knock down King Kong style. It's cool. Speaking of, have you seen the uh, Kong Skull Island trailer? I talked about it in a war story. It looks pretty cool. I don't know. I don't know if it's worth, um, like, if I would see it in the theaters, but it seems pretty cool. That's quite a, like, oh, I don't know if it's worth, like, ten bucks. Like, come on, but I mean, you can't see every single movie. And there are definitely a lot of other ones coming out this year that I'm more excited for. But, I mean, I might see it. I think it's pretty cool. As I said in the War Story, like, I'm glad that it's being connected to um, the new Godzilla, which I thought I thought was underrated. Like, people loved it, and then it became really fun and cool to hate on it. Um, I thought it was good. And so it's cool that it'll be connected with that, and they can do Godzilla versus King Kong and stuff. But it's not so cool that they they didn't just use the framework from the King Kong that Peter Jackson did because it was so freaking good. And talk about underrated. I think uh, since Peter Jackson hey, had just come off of doing, doing um, Lord of the Rings, they expected like another, something else like that. And like not every, not every movie can be Lord of the hey. Rings. Like, come on, where's the, give me the freaking figment. Careful, my chai tea. <laughs> um, yeah, not every off. movie can be Lord of the Rings. Not every movie has that kind of a budget or like, it just doesn't work like that. So. Oh. And we don't want every movie to be Lord of the Rings. I am at a loss. Oh. <laughs> okay, that's cool. I'll remember that for later. You know, you just gotta do is just touch them and drop them in immediately. I'm gonna try this for too much longer, but I think I've gotten every figment so far. This is one level that we can basically we clear out besides needing the cobwebs. Hey. There we go. There we go. We can get that tag and that... Um, I think, is that just, I think the gold ones are a permanent number of lives up and then the colored ones are like just an extra life, but I died earlier so I, I could use it. Yep. The one thing, I really like that you have the, the really slow methodical movement in this level, but um, it's kind of a drag when, yeah, when you're just trying to get somewhere fast. Oh, I already had that box there. Where did I get that? Okay, cool. 
that was a cobweb that took me forever to find because I never bothered to go all the way down that again because I already cleared out everything else like I'm doing now. But again, for the millionth time, this is not, you know, intended to be a... I think this water is too deep. Yep. Um, this is not going to be a 100% run. If for no other reason that I can't beat that stupid uh, mini game. So, um, but I'm going to get everything I can along the way. I'd like, if I end in the rank 80s or 90s, I would, I would be more, more, well, more than content with that. But it won't be that high because I'm not going to bother um, with some things. <laughs> well, I don't want to give it away. Shut up. Come on. Make your own. Find your own Tawn Hog. Uh, give me that. I like how they look like the, the little signs, like in like Chinatown or whatever. Yeah, yeah. I like how you're under constant attack, but they do like a little bit too much damage. Like, I guess, I guess the point being like, if you were normal Raz, it would just like completely mess you up. But, um, like you feel a little bit less like an opposing monster when you really have to watch out for these tiny little things that you should be able to swat away. Aggressive capacity increased, you may store more five blasts. Okay, cool, I forgot all about those. Palm bomb upgrade at 35. I am going to go back in the next episode, I'm going to collect enough to get up to 35. Um, which shouldn't take long. I should, I'll probably be there, honestly, because I'll get a bunch of more um, pigments and such as I'm doing this. I don't remember. Oh. Ugh. Oh, come on. I gotta take out that stupid turret. So it's giving me the business. Um, but anyway, the, the palm bomb upgrade is really good. If you are not familiar with this game, um, no, 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 okay. Like, you kind of hover in midair and you can just, like, rapid tap square, and then it's a big area of effect when you land. Um, midair square, by the way, that's uh, what we call that hashtag bars around here. Um, but, yeah, it's good, so it will be worth the, uh, the momentary delay. Gosh, I'm gonna die. I mean, they're giving me plentiful health. I'm just not being judicious about getting them. Is judicious? Is that the appropriate use of judicious? I think not really. Dang it! Come on. Okay. And I also would not mind if... Um, Destroying the civilian buildings would give me a bit of health as well. That would be nice. Um, gosh, I'm still sniffly, always. Like, I thought it was a cold for the longest time because I would just wake up every morning feeling like garbage. And it was like allergies. Um, if you have no idea what I'm talking about, I guess it's been a few episodes now. But, like, for, like, the whole beginning of the month of August, really, the end of July... Like, because every day I was sick, so, like, I put off recording for a long time and almost got behind, um, because of it, because I just, like, I just didn't want to record with, like, a stuffy nose or whatever, sniffling and coughing, but it's just been forever, but, um, like, I, I'm taking, like, Claritin stuff every day now, so it's been a lot, um, under a much better control, but... One of the many reasons why summer is the worst of the months, and I cannot wait for fall and then my sweet, sweet winter. <sighs> I think one reason why I like this level so much is, um, it is fun to collect all this stuff. Like, it's a lot more engaging, um, to go around just because it's cool to just, like, see the buildings break and get destroyed and stuff. Sorry about that cut there. I got, ever since the, um, the Ultratron video, which should have been up for a while by now. I don't know. I, I don't remember. Um, I'm pretty sure it will be, though. I'm paranoid about missing my video ending and then not starting the next one immediately. So I've gotten back to trying to be careful and stop it myself. I'm in time. But I also want it to be as long as I can so I can be close to the 30-minute goal I usually strive for. So, yeah. I can't remember if this is taking me to where I need to go or if this is just for fun. No, oh, I don't even need to hit that. I just destroy it. Come on, come on. No! Why? Well, I can get that at least, but no, go that way. Come on, come on, come on. We're almost there. Suitcase tag. 
I think I have, let's see, out of curiosity. So I have the other two tags, I just gotta find the things. Doing good on figments, but no vaults. I don't remember anything about the vaults in this level. We're here with the star of the popular sitcom Trouble in the Bubble, Buddy Finn. Buddy, what's your take I hear on the crying in this one. situation? Is he just misunderstood? No way! I hate Gagalor. I can't imagine any one of my fans siding with the monster. He oh, hates one. everything lungfish care about. Air, water, family, the economy. <laughs> I get the planes now we're You'll straight up King Kong. Know that the Navy has decided to pull out what they're most famous for. <laughs> Air <just> planes. <laughs> Airplanes. So rest assured, we can all look forward to Gagalor's imminent death. And to seeing you, buddy, every Thursday night at 8, right here on LVC. Thanks, and I'd just like to add that if anyone kidnaps a human child, they should take them quickly under the lake to the abandoned insane asylum. Ah, Gogolor, so come we in. Go. We have commandeered these vessels in your name. We can put them in position to help you cross Cochamara Channel to get to Cochamara Island and destroy Cochamara Tower. The thing is that, um, although we have the utmost faith that you will soon contain the area, Gogolor, we, uh... We've decided to maintain our position I don't know why I couldn't be here. bothered to say that. Just until you clear the area of all hostiles. Yes. For I'm getting kind of low reasons, on life, Gogolor. so I need to be yes, a little bit more that, um, careful. And for freedom. Especially now that I'm back in another new area with, um... Played no good next. I gotta take out all these dang airplanes. I think, um, I think I can just target them and shoot them down with Psy Blast, but I don't really remember. I'm gonna do um, some more figment hunting over here. I know I've missed some now because I left that area before I intended to. I think I have to get really high, is like the best way to fight them. Up, 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 up. There, that'll help. Well, that wasn't the most... No, somehow they took out two of them now, so I'll take that. <laughs> okay. No, we don't want to go back. We're already here. Um, I'll go back. Maybe that's what I'll do um, with my off-screen kind of grinding up to level 35 if I need to. I don't know. I don't know. I, don't know. I just go through phases of like how exactly I want to do things. Um, like, on the... Um, I um, graciously call it editing software, the little share factory crap that comes with the PS4. Like, I have the capability to, um, to fast forward clips. So I could, like for example, in the last episode when I had to fight the lungfish twice, I thought about recording me going all the way back through it, so nobody would be like, hey, you did something no good. Um, and then just fast forwarding it, so you can see the whole thing like a grinding montage would be in a Pokemon video but I couldn't be bothered. But I, I don't know, it would be like a little bit more professional, I guess, to just show everything. Bump. Didn't have to bring me all the way to the ground though, did you? These airplanes are actually not that bad. They do very little damage and they never really hit me. And I keep accidentally killing them as I've been just trying to climb the buildings to collect the stuff, so. Well, I am, I guess I am climbing the buildings to try to kill them, but you know my point. If those are supposed to be lights that are turned on, that's not, no, not, not so good. No, 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 please don't fall again. At least let me climb up and take out one. Yeah, shoot him down. Shoot him down. There we go. Freedom! <laughs> I wonder if that's like what they intended. Like some of the glitches like sound and graphics wise, like it's hard to tell if it's intended because it's all so like, thrown together and mishmashed, you know? It's almost like the animation kind of makes me think of South Park at times, or the art direction, I should say. How, like, it has a really unique, compelling look that has a lot going for it, but it's also, like, looks like they didn't care. I don't know. It's it's just cool. It looks like it didn't care. It sounds way harsher than I, than I feel. Oh, this isn't the way I need to go. I'm wasting my time. I'm wasting everybody. Oh, here's a vault, though. 
Longfish. And, oh, so this is the story. So Longfish is just watching TV. He got caught, and it's Dr. Lobato, who I don't think we had his name before. And there's Oleander in the background. So this is our evil plot. Turned him into the big old monster into the sea. So that's how the lake monster got started. He's been kidnapping the kids, bringing them to the abandoned insane asylum under the lake. So that uh, Mori and um, Dr. Lobato can pluck out their brains to power the think tanks. So that's basically what, what we got going on here. But there's some other twists and turns, as I recall. I say as I recall. I mean, I'm pretty sure about that. Oh, I don't have to even go back to, what's his name, to get the palm bomb. Nice. I think I usually get that for the first time here because it's exciting here. Oh, come on. Oh, that's one of the ones I can climb. I can't play the game for that. That wouldn't look impressive either. It's cool! Here. Oh, I like how all the fists are. Yeah, I took out like three there. That was neat, wasn't it? And I guess I do get pickups for taking down the civilian buildings. I didn't know that. So we got all the uh, emotional baggage. No, yes. There's one more vault. And only 20 more figments, so this is a pretty good... I mean, of course, I'll have to come back for the cobweb, so... I may as well just press on with finishing the level, because I'll have to come back anyway. Come on! What the heck? Oh, you only get one bounce in this level. Well, that's fair. I don't think I'll beat it, beat this level, um, this uh, episode, just because I'm kind of taking my time. But uh, in the next episode, for sure... And uh, the boss fight, I remember being a little bit on the more difficult side. So, well, um, yeah. I guess, actually, we might cut this episode the tiniest bit short um, as we get to Kochamara Island here. Because I think it's like a whole other area. Well, we're sorry to report that the miserable and incompetent lungfaced Navy Or maybe it'll be a little bit longer suck. and I'll just finish it all off. Great we'll see work, uh, how this ends up being. Now, Kochamara himself will have to come all the way down here just to save our worthless hides. Authorities are calling for a big parade in Kochamara's honor after he clobbers the annoying <laughs> giant Gogalore. And if the parade is big enough, Kochamara promises not to destroy the city. Yeah, you, go. you can't do any better than that. Often don't do so much. Well, that's some good brainwashing. Brainwashing, teeth washing. Yeah, let's go ahead and do it. Um, it might cut off again. I don't know where I'm at. I used to be really good about having a, um, a timer for this sort of stuff. But no, we just gonna do it. We just gonna do it. Hey, everyone! Here comes Kochamara! Kochamara is awesome. This is my favorite boss fight in the game, bar none. Oh, that, well, actually, there's another one that's really good, too, but this one's awesome. This one's definitely more mimetic. I don't know. Because it's a giant, it's a kaiju fight, essentially. I could not have, that could not have been telegraphed more. And you'll see that's a theme of this fight. <laughs> <laughs> you should have done the eh, eh, eh. Okay, that kick thing. Can people do really do that? I wonder about that. I'm, I'm sure you can, but I don't know if I've ever seen a real purple person in real circumstances do that. That was a disappointing kip up. See, Coach Hammer's even bigger than I am in this world. I wonder if he is real or if he's also projected into the mind. Can, I know it's you in there, Coach. Oh, there we go. I don't know where you're broadcasting from, but I'm gonna I find have four out lives. Oh, I can beat it. Kochamara does not speak giant monster boy language. The only word you're gonna need is ouch. Oh, well, I guess I can shoot him. Ram. So all of his attacks, he says them out before Bye. he does it, and they're so Ram. awesome. No, yeah, well, as I get hit. Deadly triangle beam. <laughs> Mighty Ram. Oh, come on, I dodged that. All right, hit me with that Bye. triangle beam. Ram. You can't really do the evasion unless you're locked onto him, and you can't really lock onto him because he's moving around. Deadly triangle beam. There we go. That's how we do the damage. That's how we do the dang thing. Ram. <coughs> I dodged it so expertly the first time, but triangle beam. there we go. Hit him with that deadly triangle beam. Mighty Ram. There we go. That was better. Let me get that health. Mighty there we go. Well, I'm kind of doing better now. Triangle, Triangle beam. beam. <laughs> the good attacks haven't even come yet. So 
Sasha showed you how to save up your aggressive energy, huh? I haven't even done well, the blast to your knowledge, right? Help you. Let it all out. Oh, he takes all my blasts, that's right. <laughs> Mighty Rail Ground version. Ground version. Overly the intricate intricate combination. I don't really know where I'm supposed to attack. To avoid area attack. Oh, oh okay, that's. So we're dodging the other ones and then shielding the overly intricate time. Triangle beam. Overly intricate combination, just like how this works. This this fight's not so bad. I probably Fight won't die. Nope. I knew that one was gonna hit me. I knew it. I, I attempted fate. Deadly triangle, triangle beam. beam. His little hand motion he does during that is cool. Mighty Ram! The other boss fight, like, uh, I know Holy Mighty Diver, for one, if you watch this episode, Ram! would be upset at me for saying that any boss fight in this game rivals this one. But the other Deadly one is, like, clever. Triangle beam. I mean, this one's clever, too, and funny, but I don't know. Deadly I guess this one's my favorite, because that other one is kind of, like, piddly. Ram! Ground vision. Fiddly. I should say not piddly. Come on. Overly intricate combination. combination. All right, hit me with that hard to avoid area attack, please. To avoid area attack. Oh, ah! Might, mighty round. I need that help. Hard to avoid. All right, here we go. This will finish him off. Area attack. Oh. You're done. You're done. You're done. There we go. Coach Amara. I just thought of People that. People of Lungfishopolis, I'm sorry I let you down. He sounds like he cares. Oh. Gig. Finally. Okay, Tower, get ready for Gogalore. Let's do this. I am really hurting. I should probably get some health first, just in case something else happens, but I don't think it does. That music is kind of disappointing here. For a game with such incredible music, it's a little bit boring. Like, I know they're doing, like, the Godzilla stuff, like, uh, some Ojo's music, but I, I kind of wish it had a little bit more life to it. More comic booky, maybe. Do you find him again? No. Oh, okay, cool. Good job, Raz. control of this freaky toad i don't need him to nab children for me anymore i've got the brain of a little girl back in my lab that's strong enough to power a whole army of psycho blaster death tanks why am i laughing <laughs> it's my girlfriend wow, you've got the brain of a little girl <laughs> i said in my lab i think you've got the muscles of a little girl too <laughs> got him uh, good one Yay, now they love me. That's right. I wish I could use the ball and just squish. <laughs> Yay, we did it. Human child. <laughs> I forgot all that? about this. It is I, the creature whose spirit was once, um, <clears throat> over here. Behind you. Yes. Oh. The creature whose spirit was once enslaved by the evil one. You have unchained my soul, human child. Oh, Sorry about that cut. I knew it would cut off if right. I went too far, but. Well, okay. Show me what you did. He to said my he's gonna room. pay me back for saving him. Spirit of Oblongata. It is done. This this place is called Lake Oblongata, which is pretty cool. See, so yeah, he said he'd owe me a favor, and I said, okay, show me what you did with Lily. So he's bringing me to. The asylum. I don't know if I can get back to the to the regular camp after this. I'm sure I can. I think you you like talk to the long vision of ring. I'm sure you can. That's way too much. 
When it is your wish to travel across the lake, you may return there, there to either shore and summon me with that. No, the Thanks, lungfish calls. Hulking lungfish. You know, you really aren't as hideous as people say. You may call me now by my true name, Rasputin. It's like Debbie or something. I can't remember it. By my something, something silly. And what name is that noble lake creature? Linda. There you go. What a magical lady. Silly names never get old. So now here we are at the old abandoned insane asylum that will be the setting for the most of the remainder of our journey. But um, that's gonna do it for us today. We saved the lone fish. I wanna go ahead and grab this. Um, in the next episode, we'll actually pop back across to the main island and do some collecting and trading some stuff in to old crawler so that um, dang icon isn't bothering us the whole time. And then we will move on to the first order of the asylum in which I very, unless I very much miss my guess, is my other favorite besides Longfish Oppo. So thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you subscribe so you don't miss any Psychonauts every Monday and Friday. And there's something every single day here on the Florence's channel. My name has been Jericho. I'll see y'all next time. I don't know about you guys, but I'm full.